Welcome lovelies and lovettes. I'm going to be playing a Polytopia. Uh, it says multiplayer, but I am going to be playing alone. The reason for that being is because this and normal single player, it just plays differently. And I like the way the multiplayer plays. I'm going to be adding in a lot of bots. You just send them all in. Are crazy bots which means that they're the hardest difficulty and very annoying to take down especially when I add in the max amount that I could possibly fit which is I believe like 13 or so I I don't count them there we go now my tribe going to be playing as the uh Hmm. Hmm, now we're on. Sure, whatever. The other ones are a bit overpowered, but I want to play as them just for the fun of it. I mean, I guess my first time playing around, you, you guys probably f first thing that you see on my channel, at least for some of you. I want to know why they're four prizes because this. I have two units. Don't even cost me nothing. And I'll be doing that every time. So, yeah. Turvy up. You're kidding me right now. Okay, there we go. I guess, I don't know, whatever. Yeah, it's that Elrond or Elves, as I'm going to be calling them. Elves are dumb, they're always going to be dumb, but that's because they're overpowered and I'm just going to be playing as them on 13, yeah, because, uh, their overpoweredness is amusing, I could, I'll say. They're not fair, like, in the slightest. It's like, their super unit is overpowered. Uh, the Politars are also overpowered. Like, these guys all have, like, massive armies with them. This, this is one thing I like about the, uh, multiplayer, is that it gives you the thing to, like, take uh, other th knowledges from other people. Another thing about the elves, these glowing crystal here, and all these ones here, those are all the ruins. They have the ability to just see them from the start. Bit overpowered in my opinion. But that's the Elrond. I'm going to be saving up for forestry because I get this thing and it's overpowered, to say the least. Probably going to hear me just complaining about how overpowered the elves are. But once they actually start getting more deeper into actual game, like more mid-game-ish, you're going to like see what I'm talking about and you're going to be seeing that I am right. Like, I'm going to be dominating everything around me. Because I'm correct. Oh, I took it. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. That sucks. This guy's nothing useful near him. And the one thing that makes the elves overpowered is the amount of units they're able to field. Because each uh, other city, tribe, they have like a max amount of units. But these guys are able to field an endless number of soldiers. 
It's like quite absurd. Dang. Because the Politar does three damage, or um, I guess he has tier three damage right off the start. There's only like a few units that actually have that level of damage. And I mean, I do like the Politars because, like, whatever animal they're based, like, you enchant them from, they will have the same head, which is kind of funny with, like, uh, the one emu looking bird things. I see the guys from here who I stole out of that technology. Bam. Here, stole farming. Nice. Threaten me, will ya? Yeah, as you can you guys can see, everything is currently going smoothly. Things that I want to be going on, they're going on. And to me, it may look like I'm losing right now, like doing awful. That's because I am I'm doing real bad. But the elves are good at doing real bad. Give me that city. Give me it. Gonna be mine. I want it. The Kikaru have been killed. Well, that's one less problem for me. Oh, look, there's the coward who ran for his life. Only fools value their life. I'm not just kidding. Everyone should value your, their life because all life is valuable, except the lives of my enemies. Then just, just, let's just slaughter them all. You could slaughter elves too, just buy the bushel. Just buy a real big blender if you're having a problem with like doing all of them at once. It's real helpful. Boom. Because once I get that sanctuary thing, then things are really going to start going my way. As you will see, because these guys, their main thing is making the, like poly, the polytars at the start. And a sanctuary will attract an enemy every three turns. Which is really good. Or not enemy... This enemy will attract an animal every three turns. You're kidding me. No, oh, never mind. All good. And so once I. Oh, yeah. You can see the bird right here. I'm gonna turn him into a polytar and he's going to look funny. Trust me when I say that. But also, if I lose a sanctuary, that's gonna be really bad because enemies could just end up like endlessly generating like a population off of the hunting. Like, it'll like, it'll attract an animal and then you just hunt the animal. Yep, all their trades is destroyed. All their trades gone, and then they're gone. Blighthart. Gonna heal up with these guys. Send him forward. City wall. Move him forward. Hit him. 
Uh, that's... And it may have not been the smartest to play. I I should have paid attention. Who's first? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna pay for that dumb decision that I see. Yep. Mm, I deserve that. Let's start it up. So I will be taking that back. It will be mine because I will say so. Mm, look, they both have shields. Ooh, secret of roads. Dunk, dunk, funk, and uh, could save it. I don't know why I'm not saving it for the sanctuary. It's most likely just because I'm an idiot. But if you guys are going to be sticking around for my channel, just get used to it. Oh, look, we can't be using Well, I'd like to see you live. I mean, it's, it's an easy task, living. But dying is a lot easier, trust me. I know a lot about dying. Well, killing, really, but... I mean, like, tomato, tomato. Inflicting dying. Next so you are suffering from death. Oh, that's, that's real bad, because they're going to try taking that from me. Mm. Mm, not much not good. Good farm. Crap, going to have to go for resources. Is that, I like city walls, that's like... They help with defense a lot. So when your unit is in them, they'll take less damage. Me, I'll oh, go back. I, I'm a lot better at not getting murdered to death. So they're putting out some archers, but I'm going to be putting out some dead enemies. Dead enemies. Yeah. So it's going to be a lot of fighting I'm going to have to go through. And it may look like I'm not making any promises, or not promises, but progress. Which, like tomato tomato on that. Ooh, Gator Power. And put Booski, Border Growth. Wham. And create a unit. So get up and slam, and then you're all like, wow. Send him down, send him into him. Oh, need eight. Mm. Farm. End it. I have to make more defenders. One man pushing through the gaps. And we will break them. And they shall all fight. Or no, they shall all fall to the Mighty me, the true god emperor of the universe. Heal up. Crap. 
Actually, that's not too horrible. Boom. Now I shall be pumping in a powerful Politars. Politars are not good at def countering attacking. Oh, look at me, I'm just gonna be murdering up your doof. I'm gonna be murdering up your family. The Vengear. Hmm. I expect the Vengear to die as fast. Vengear are pretty powerful because they start with the knights. And those are. Like, the knights are the best non cavalry unit. Cavalry is the best. I'm like. And you're looking at all around best and cavalry definitely. And if you look on second place best, then it's either the uh, catapult, yeah, the catapult would be second, and then warrior third. And yeah, yeah, yeah. So make a sanctuary here. A low level sanctuary, but yeah, whatever. Don't have anything else I can make. End it now. So I'm, I'm almost taking this. The city's gonna be mine. Huh. It's not gonna be mine. Oh dear god, no. This couldn't have. Okay, well, if I lose that side, I'm just gonna keep pushing on the other way. So, the more they push towards me, the more they're going to be dead. You gotta make sure that every inch of ground they gain will be like t like dipping your pinky toe <sighs> you know I like to claim that I'm good at this game but despite everything you are currently staring at I am pretty good at this game just not when it's against 13 crazy bots. Although I have beaten 30, not 30, 13 crazy bots before. I do promise you that. And then of course he doesn't charge the archers. Racist. This guy has a thing against elves, which I respect. I have a thing against elves as well. I mean, elves are dumb. They're, they're bad. Like every fantasy ever. Let me pause it for a sec. Okay, okay. I am back. Yeah. Yeah. Why you? I didn't know that. I never knew that I'd lose. Yeah, we got ten every guy who dies. Well, but I get 10 every time a guy alives himself. Yeah, oh. I completely forgot about one small detail about the giant super units. They take a while. See this egg here? Dragon egg. Takes three turns, goes into a baby dragon. As you can see, zero attack. Do this thing. If it gets caught out, it will die. But once these guys grow into the fire dragon they will kill everything the aquarians are also dead
because sometimes I can play this game against my friends. And that would do really good. That's because my friends are kind of they're just generally in general bad. Chant animal run. Okay, so those guys they're fighting it out. So I'm I'm probably gonna end up acting like a scavenger when it comes to them. Or no the barter. Oops, there goes my capital. This, this didn't go well. Pass. Secret of Shields. Alright. Enchant Animal. Wham. Yeah. And you guys continue to run for your lives. And that's another good thing about sanctuaries is that here you'll be able to create one unit turn from each of these things, each city, but you also get one from the forest every thir three turns. It's pretty good. Also, if you just end up letting the, uh, the sanctuaries build up. The guy made it dumb for a single turn. A single turn will, turn will cost him. Come on, barter. Can't we just be friends? But why does it always have to be like me who they go after? I mean, like, can't they just murder each other? I mean, I know that's off in the distance there's like big group of retards never mind I guess that, that their mistake isn't going to cost them dearly or as dearly as I thought it would yeah oh they're going to be Real upset. Did, 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 did that guy shoot? They didn't capture my city. The fools. They're gonna regret not capturing my city because I'm gonna be taking it back this turn. And once I take it, eh, ooh, yeah, 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 boy, slam my way into their face. So that's the thing that I like to do. Get far range. And if you're talented enough to get them up to their max level, or age, I guess, whatever. Mm. I'll get climbing. Yeah, that's good. Do those two both have it? In turn. That's, that's very much not good. It's, I mean, I delayed them for
for another turn, which that's all I really managed to do. But that's all I was really trying to do. I mean, I wish the dragons were more tanky so that way I could go and just slam straight into their throats. You know, take them out when they don't, well, won't expect it. Wham. Chant animal. You go off there. Make a defender. You retreat. You slam into him. You don't slam straight into him. Hmm. Nothing's going good, but you made a good distraction. Da da da. Uh, yeah, be careful. I'm currently between a rock and a hard place, and I shall be kicking and fighting until my last drop of blood has been spilt from my body because I do not surrender easily I will never surrender wham wham run Cover, go there, boom, the Mr's archery. Oh, oh, this is good. This is good. Two fire dragons, pretty overpowered. Now I'm gonna show you why. On this little Zabetsy giant, who has been. Harassing me non stop. Sebasti. The Yataka has been killed. Because with these guys, with fire dragons, especially since I have these two of them, it's unstoppable. I mean, they can still easily kill me, but my fire dragons are going to be making that a pain. Here, boom. See? Yeah, they also hit everyone around. Boom. Look at that. Exterminatus. They look, they have dash. This unit can move after attacking fly and splash, and they're the only units in the game with full fly and splash. Well, technically, th their earlier versions have fly, the baby dragons, but they are the only unit in the entirety of the game to have a splash. Mm, I do not like the way they are attacking me. I don't appreciate that. Yeah, they don't have the splash when they're counter-attacking. But they do at every other moment. And currently, they're surrounding me at every opportunity they have. Which is really something I do not appreciate of. Very bad in many ways. Who's saying to check about animal? Dang it, can't get it. Fire right there. If I can. Yeah. Because these guys, they can't actually capture cities because of their fire. So I need to try to push to here. And hopefully I am not killed before I get there. Well, 
I'm dead. This was the fun game, but getting attacked by everyone at once. Duh. I'll win eventually at one of these games. You you can bet on that. But in the meantime, this was fun. I actually enjoyed it a lot. Enjoyed the nobody who was hanging out and watching my video. So the I have four subscribers who I believe there was people who forgot to hit the unsubscribe button after I uploaded my no videos. I too bad you picked on roads. If I only did have one more turn. But actually, actually, no, it's not time to give up hope. <clears throat> please, 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 no. I forgot Lucid. I see. Yep, sizing when. I did not have a good holding. I was hoping that like their giant may have ended up attacking them because they will sometimes do that, just attack the other guy. And then that would allow me to just steal that capital with my defender. If... But that didn't happen. So, goodbye. See you all, hopefully again.